Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I'm Greg and this is a 35 Chev. This thing is unbelievable. Rotisserie restored, suicide doors, 350 under the hood. Man, she is gorgeous. Look at that grill. Man, that grill is custom and looking sweet. I love the color of this car. This is my favorite color on any car. Man, I love it. I actually had a truck this color, a motorcycle this color. I love it. Man, I've actually already driven this car. We had a blast driving it. She is a beauty. Now the fiberglass fenders, running boards and rear fenders, other than that, the car is all steel. And check this out suicide doors those babies are steel now they used 40 plymouth hinges and some of the mechanisms from a uh, 40 plymouth to build these doors what a sweet job they did too and look at the interior on this baby you want to talk about award-winning take this car anywhere i guarantee you you're going home with the ribbons on this one this thing is sweet this interior is off the hook. It is beautiful. Tilt column, automatic. It's a four-speed automatic, by the way. The dash is unbelievable. Now, the trunk has got an automatic popper right here. Just hit that button, and look at that. Isn't that amazing? You want to talk about beautiful workmanship? It's everywhere on this car. Now there's not a lot of room in there, but I suppose you could get a little set of golf clubs in there, a couple of little fold up lawn chairs, and maybe a small tent, maybe a small cooler. Just absolutely beautiful. They Frenched in the uh, tail lights, looking sweet. And just look at the workmanship on all the bodywork and the spray on the paint. It's got a real fine metallic in it, just looking sweet. She is a beauty. Look at that. And that's, I just can't get over these doors. The doors are just unbelievable. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we don't do any consignment work whatsoever. That means we own this Chevy. So you can bet we spent the time to check it out before we bought it. Once we get them here to the shop, we get them up on the lift and go through them and inspect them so we can answer all your questions. So please call Tom, ask him anything you want. He can answer all your questions. If you want any close-up pictures of anything on the car, just ask. We'll get those close-up pictures right out to you. Now, I've got about 35 years of experience in the business, and I'm using all of that experience to help you pick out your dream car. sweet and we can deliver it anywhere you just call Tom at 248-974-9513 Tom will explain the whole process to you and how easy it is now we can also help you out with financing call him anytime Tom answers his phone seven days a week and practically 24 hours a day so you just give that man a call. If he does not pick up the phone, he will call you back. Now we're right outside the Motor City. We're very close to the airport. So if you'd like to come check out this car or anything else we have in stock, we'd love to have you come out. We do sell about 95% of our stuff sight unseen on the internet. But we do love to have our customers come out. As a matter of fact, if you see Tom or I at a car show, 
or an auction or something, please come on up and meet us. We'd love to talk to you about cars. Now you can see down here on the dash, all the gauges are working. Everything's looking sweet. Now it does look like the Speedo is not calibrated right now, but that's one thing that we make sure is working as soon as it leaves. So I'll make sure that the guys get that Speedo working before this baby hits your driveway. Even the horn's working. It's got a tilt column in it. Now there's plenty of room in this baby. Now I'm six foot tall. My cameraman is about six foot two. And we're both big guys. I'm two and a quarter. And uh, we fit in here just fine. This thing's driving great, looking great. What a wonderful machine, man. Now we're gonna get her up on the lift. Nobody else in the industry does that. And now this thing is just as beautiful on the bottom side as it is on the top. Now here's our building here. We're at 15100 Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. So stick with us. We're gonna put it up on the lift for you right now. All right, we're underneath this beauty now, and I tell you what, it is a beauty. You're definitely gonna have to invest in some mirrors so you can show off the beautiful workmanship on the bottom of this Chevy. Look at that gas tank. That is stainless steel. Look at those TIG welds. It looks like my wife did that with her sewing machine. Look at that. It is beautiful. Look at this paint job. I tell you what, I cannot tell whether this is powder coat or paint job. That is how nice this is. It is gorgeous under here. All the shocks are polished up. All the nuts and bolts are polished up. Now we do have drum brakes in the back. Now even though this is so pretty under here, the guys will still take the brakes apart, make sure that all the seals are good, make sure everything's installed correctly. You can see the stainless steel exhaust here looking sweet. They got band clamps on everything so that you can take it apart if you'd like. You can see the drive shaft's got beautiful paint and or powder coat on it. The frame is nicely painted. That's why we put the rags on here so we don't mess up any of the paint work here. You can see that they've run all the wiring tight inside the frame here, all the brake lines. Now that's the proportioning valve for the brakes so you can control how much pressure's going back there to the rear brakes. We've got the trans cooler here, very cool unit. We do have the uh, master cylinder and the brake booster are mounted underneath. Of course, the uh, Running boards and the rear fenders are fiberglass on the car. Even these brackets are all beautifully painted. They did a beautiful work job here on the frame. Look at this. They've smoothed all the welds. They've done finish work on the entire frame. It just looks beautiful under here. Now the calipers up front here, everything looks sweet up here. They've painted those up to look the same as the uh, car, even the spindles. Uh, the lower and upper control arms are tubular. It does look like a Mustang II setup here. Um, we've got coilovers and shocks holding up the front, and they're all polished up. We do have rack and pinion steering, and it is manual rack and pinion steering. And don't worry about the rack and pinion being manual on this car. It's nice and light up here, and the gear ratio makes it real nice and easy to steer. Uh, front frame horns, nice and straight, of course, and nicely painted. Front fenders, of course, are also fiberglass and nicely coated on the inside. Like I said, this baby is clean underneath. Uh, American Racing wheels, uh, the aluminum's looking sweet, 195-55-16s here. Look at the paintwork there on the frame. Even the paintwork on the motor's looking sweet. We got jet coated headers, and you can see they polished up this part of the exhaust right here. Looking great. Let's see what's on the rear here. Now, out back here, we got the same good looking American Racing wheels, and we've got two 35 55 17s out back. And then look at the end of that tank. Look at that polish work. Man, that looks sweet. Well, let's get under the hood and see what's making power under there. And I think I forgot to mention the transmission is a four-speed automatic. Now we'll look at the motor. All right, under the hood here, we got a fuel-injected 350, and everything that can be chrome is chrome. Everything that can be polished is polished. This thing is beautiful, guys. 
Um, I already told you it's fuel injected. It's a 91 model 350, jet coated headers, uh, alternator, all polished up, AC compressor, all polished up. I already showed you the power brakes underneath. Um, she is a beauty, guys. Um, what else can I tell you? The distributor's mounted back here in the back. It looks like a uh, MSD setup. I do see the MSD coil in there. There is the, um, all the AC lines are all steel braided. Very nice, neat job. Firewall's nicely painted. Love the color on the car. Of course, electric fan on the radiator. Um, I'm holding the hood up. It does have a prop rod here, but it, it, um, it's not. It, it's down here pretty low. I wanted you to make sure you could see it underneath the hood real well. Um, she's a gorgeous car, guys. Call us, 248-974-9513, and let Vanguard Motor Sales park this dream in your driveway.